Uh, welcome back to our blog. Again, I'm Justin Carney, Director of Production with Charleston Homes. Uh, today I wanted to just touch on a few items that you can, uh, some maintenance tips, things you can do to your exterior concrete just to uh, maintain the life and longevity uh, of the concrete uh, for many years to come. All right, the first thing you can do to protect your exterior flat work is obviously just keep make sure it's kept clean at all times. Uh, just a, a brooming every so often. You can also hose down the concrete uh, just to keep the surface clean and uh, free of debris. Uh, one thing that I'll point out is a lot of people like to power wash their driveways in the uh, middle of summer. Uh, just be careful on doing that, especially on the very warm days, the very hot days. Uh, what happens is if you've got an extremely warm day where the temperatures are approaching 100 degrees and you start power washing your driveway with very cold water coming out of the tap, you create a stress on the surface of your concrete that can in turn do some damage and uh, cause damage that you might not see right away but in the future could potentially cause spalling uh, where the surface of the concrete starts to pit away. All right, an another tip with regards to keeping your driveway clean is it's uh, vitally important in the winter time to make sure you keep up on that. Uh, what happens in the winter time is when you're driving out on the streets, uh, you know, the city puts uh, a salt and brine mix down on the streets. Well, what happens is when you track that up on your tires and drive up into your driveway, you're tracking that salt um, and brine solution up onto your driveway. Well, what that does is uh, that salt and brine solution starts to eat away the surface of your concrete. Uh, so you want to make sure and keep that stuff cleaned off and broomed off the driveway as soon as possible. That will just uh, also protect your driveway uh, from the effects of spalling. Now spalling is one thing which is very hard to prevent. Obviously by keeping the driveway clean you can minimize the effects of spalling. Uh, one other method to, to help minimize that is to seal your driveway and all, all of your exterior concrete with a penetrating sealer. And you want to make sure that the penetrating sealer follows the concrete standard uh, ASTM C309. That's the con uh, concrete industry specific standard as far as driveway sealers are concerned. All right, another item on your uh, exterior concrete that you want to watch is your control joints in your uh, driveway as well as your sidewalks. And what I'm talking about here is the joints that we purposely cut into your driveway uh, when it's freshly poured. Obviously, these are the areas where we, we hope to force your concrete to crack. We know all concrete's going to crack. Concrete uh, shrinks up to a quarter of an inch in 10 feet as it cures. Uh, now what you can do, um, obviously to protect these cracks, once they do um, uh, crack through down into the bottom, which you can see these are already cracked, you might not be able to see on film, but it is cracked down in here, you want to prevent that ice uh, snow mixture from penetrating down in there because the freeze thaw action is what can damage the surface of your exterior concrete. So to prevent that, you can um, use a concrete crack fill uh, type material to fill in these joints or a Volcom style product uh, to fill in these joints. Uh, that will help prevent any moisture from seeping down into the cracks, which in turn will just um, uh, prolong the life um, of your exterior concrete for many years to come. Thanks again for visiting our blog. For more tips, feel free to stop by our models at uh, Saddlebrook or Portal Ridge anytime you're out in the area, or you can visit us on our website at charlestonhomesomaha.com. Thanks.